everybody what the fuck is going on welcome back to cooking with bird martinez the one the only bird motherfucking teenage bitch say it louder for the bitches in the back all the bitches in the back all the puta sucias in the way back <laughs> and to all my pretty ass sucias from the front what's up what's up what's going on what's really really going on so today of course my little horse we have my marvelous mandy mira que chulada she is so relaxed right now because <laughs> finally se calmó la situación earlier. She's in honors math, right? So, um, como se dice? She doesn't have regular tests, regular homework. Toda su pinche madre que tiene is like extra as fuck. Mm -hmm. Your math that you have today, it looked like some astronaut shit. <laughs> I was driving. She didn't even go with me to the post office because she always goes with me. But I knew she was stressed, so I kind of like, you know, tried to not put as much stress on her and just do shit on myself like all by myself this time like for real i was like <laughs> oh by myself <laughs> so we're with you but look we went to the post office i said sofia put your mask on we're gonna get off ¿Qué crees que estupida hizo? she's like putting her makeup on she's like mm. But you guys, it was almost five. Yeah, that's why. And I wanted to make it. Because if I, I could go to the other post office at six, but then I have to pick up some shirts. Um, and that closes at 5.30. So I was like really in a rush. But anyways, Sofia estaba así, mira. Putting makeup on. I don't know what the fuck she was doing. I'm like, Sofia, put your mask on. We get there. She didn't have a mask on. She was looking for one. She had to open the package. She's always doing that. Mm -hmm. And I was like, pinche Sofia, relájate. I don't want to get mad at her because we were already like in a tense, you know? I don't want to be like evil or mean. So I was like, pinche Sofia. We, I run now and I'm trying to get to the post. I'm like, Sofia, hurry, hurry up. She's like, mommy, don't leave me alone in front of everybody. Like, I'm going to leave my child alone. Oh my so goodness. dramatic. But anyways, we made it to the post office. The guy, El Gordito, he's always nice to me now. Remember he used to be an asshole? Yeah. Now he's nice. But anyways, today we're going to do something really, really special. You know what I'm saying? Caldo de pollo. Caldo de pollito. Pollito. What's pollo? Pollo. You said pollo. I said pollo. I don't know. I'm weird. But anyways, um, first I want to give a special shout out to... ¿Cómo, de, cómo dice la Farm Life with Kids. You know what I'm saying? She has her YouTube. Y, you know, she, it's like plants and shit. And she has a farm? Yeah. Wow. He planta cosas and it's really into her channel's pretty good. So go check her out. You know what I'm saying? You know it's hard fucking you está bien culero like te, te recomienda, no te recomienda, you can't curse, you can't say panoche, you can't say culo, you can say fuck it, fuck, fuck, fuck. Everybody oh my goodness of me. <gasps> oh my god. ¿Qué importa? Yo no sé por qué la gente se hace muy acá. Ay, cursing. But anyway, remember yesterday the guy from Target? You guys said he was a killer? I think it was a killer. You guys are mean. Oh my, I'm sorry. I just get feelings for people. Too much fucking crime watch daily. So anyways, ahora vamos a limpiar a la esta Mandy. Porque está bien pinche loca. She cries one second. The other second, she's happy. She gives me a hard time. So dramática. Tóxica, no es cierto. We're not no eres tóxica. tóxica. No eres tóxica. It's not get twisted, okay? Es con esta me ha limpiado. You could actually limpiar con el pasote. Because I remember the smell. Yes. Okay. So for this pollo, we're gonna pollo. use pollo. We're gonna use <laughs> for this caldo de pollo. We're gonna use a pollo, and I'm gonna show you how to cut a pollo. Because when I was 18, I didn't know how to do it. I'm gonna cut one, and you're gonna cut the other one. Sí. Sale vale? Sale vale. Okay. Of course, my little horse. We're gonna use some corn, fresh corn for that ass. ¿Qué más? A potato. Papas, golden potatoes. Mandy's favorite. Calabaza. Calabacita. I love this. One. They're so bomb, huh? I'm um, in carrots. Carrots. Mm -hmm. Um, chayote. I thought it was like cool or something. Pulito <laughs> con papas, papas. Twerk, 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 twerk. If you eat ass, eat this. What? <laughs> what else, mother? Onion? I onion? And salt. Salt? Garlic? Maybe some rice. I'm not sure. Should I put some rice in it? What seasonings are you gonna put? The chicken flavor bouillon, of course. Aquí está. Chicken flavor bouillon? Yeah. Chingue su madre. Damn, Mandy, you're looking beautiful. All right, see you too, me. Yo nomás me pinto, me quito, me, me pinto y me pongo una mask. Y ya. <laughs> the video that I uploaded of my day in my life, oh my goodness. I really showed myself, like, nothing. No makeup y todo, todo. Mm. Pero ya cuando he hecho el mame, ya, it, like, refreshes my face. So, yeah, let's do it. My little horse, we have the one. 
The Only. Sofía la tortilla. ¿Cómo estás, amiga? Muy bien, ¿cómo estás tú? ¿Cómo están los hijos? No, hijos. ¿Y por qué no, hijos? Me don't know how to wipe my cologne. Why are you blinking like that? No sé. Estás bien pinche sabada, igual que tu madre. Okay, motherfuckers, so I got my water. I'm just gonna have my water heating up. I'm put a piece of onion, two laurel leaves, bay leaves, or whatever, and some salt. Chinga su madre. Cabrona, yo soy tu madre, hija de la chingada. Okay, motherfuckers, I'm gonna cut the pollo. I'm gonna teach you guys. Well, this is how I know. Porque this is like science. Cutting a pollo is like literally science. Okay, okay. okay I look so short. Imagine I was this short. Would you guys feel weird to have a mom this short? Sí, no. But I see it all the time. Don't you guys always see it when we walk around? Yeah. Like the mom is shorter than everybody? Okay. It's so weird. So now we're gonna cut the pollo. So now we're gonna cut the pollo. Ooh, ooh. Pollo. Pollo. So for a pollo, you just have to cut the coyunturas. What the coyunturas are is like, see right here? In the middle? If it was to, you were gonna cut me, you would have to cut like the middle to cut the part. So you feel it right here, right? I think it's right here. And then you go like this. And then you just cut it. And like this, see? Easy peasy, mac and motherfucking cheesy. Also, you save money when you get a whole pollo. Because you get chicken breast, you get the legs, you get the thighs. And my favorite part, my favorite part is the spinazo, creo que se llama. Okay, so you want to do the chicken leg, Sofia? Then she's, and then Sofia, you're going to do the chicken wing. Here. Okay. Estamos ready. Are you ready, Freddy? Mírala, 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 mírala. Remember, feel the coyuntura, feel the coyuntura. Because if you don't get the coyuntura, then you're going to cut the hueso. I thought you got it. You kind of have to feel it. A ver. So it's like this. See? Mm -hmm. if, you, if you get right there, see, it was, gonna get, it was getting hard because you were cutting the bone. But yeah, you live and you learn, dude. And also, this part, we're gonna cut the um the fatness. Let's see, cause we don't need all that extraness. Some Mexicans they love this shit, but I think it's nasty. It's bad for you. In caldo, no está bueno. I like it when it's like crispy, you know, fried, Sofia. Mm -hmm. You know, last night when I made the chicken like a little crispy, but when it's just boiled, you don't need it. Oh yeah, it's nasty. Yeah, and then you put the pieces like that. Yeah, ya chingo. And here's the ala. You know, there's like videos of YouTube that people teaching people how to cut chicken. And everybody mm. cuts it differently. I remember the first time I cut chicken by myself, I got like freaking like 10 different parts. You want to try? You don't do it. A ver, Sofia. I'm ready. I, I was waiting for you to see if you were going to speak up. Or te vas a hacer way. Be careful with your fingers. Okay. Go, go, go. Do it, do it. You have to do a little bit over here. Okay. Go. Yeah, can I just? Yeah, do it, do it. I feel like the skin is bad for you. It is bad for you. Mira, look at all this, this extraness. Mira, you don't need that shit. Extraness. But I'll tell you some people like Mexicans, they always think, ah, it's the flavor, it's the flavor. The flavor. El sabor. Be careful, Mama. I'm gonna going to stab your ass. Mama, are you going to take out the things inside or leave it? You like the things inside? No, because I really want to take it out. What's up? Ah. Okay. Because I have a crack. Yeah, that's how you have to crack it. Okay. This right here is your... Grandpa's favorite part, the pechuga. The pechuga? Mm-hmm. Okay. The pechuga isn't a vegetable? Lechuga, that's different. Oh. Come here. The puzzle. Um, can I take the thing from inside? Yeah. Ew. Ew. Two chicken breasts. I don't know, I'm doing it right. The seguro people are looking at me like, what the fuck is this bitch doing? But yo si corto el pollo. My mom said that she, nobody ever taught her. She just fucked around and learned. Oh. Yeah. And I said, and I said, but didn't you ask your mom? She said, my mom just expected us to know how to cook. That's like, weird. That's fucked up. How do you just expect for your kid to know how to fucking cook? Weird ass abuelita. No, la pata. I don't fucking care. 
Who took this off? Si puedes, okay. So this is my favorite part right here. This. What is that? El espinazo. That's like the, the spine. The spine. Yeah, I love the spine. <laughs> what? It's like the um, freaky, freaky decay. Yeah. What is this? Son los muslos, no? Sí. So you wanna hear something crap? Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Now we're gonna wash the pollo. ¿Qué pasó, mami? Wash the spoon. Are you tired? Yes. What do you get tired of? Watching? I get tired standing up. Oh, uh, I have the pollo in there. All up in there. The girls were not feeling the chicken. They were like, ew, you're feeding the chicken. I didn't kill it, I'm just cooking it. The fuck? Yo sé que tiene su nuevo amor. Sin embargo, te deseo lo mejor. Como la flor, como la flor, con tanto amor, con tanto amor, me diste tú. Se marchito, me marcho hoy, hoy. Yo sé perder, pero ay, como me huele la panocha. <laughs> so anyways, um, I was gonna tell you guys, what do you guys think about the new Netflix series of Selena? You know what I'm saying? Mandy's, uh, Mandy, Mandy, all up in here. You weren't even, I didn't even know you were here. <gasps> Mommy. Okay, so, can I see? Selena's my idol, okay? She's the only girl that's like, super famous I can relate to as a Mexican-American. She's brown. She's um, unapologetic. She's proud of her Mexican heritage. And the actors they cast for her is half white? What? Are you basically saying that a Mexican girl's not good enough to play Selena? And also, this is kind of weird about how Selena was just put, like, they're, um, they're using a 30 year old to play Selena when she's like 15 years old. You know, how many, weird. you know how many Selena's little girls would like die to play young Selena? A lot of girls. They should give a little girl an opportunity. Come on, yo. I'm 33. How am I gonna dress up as a 14 year old? As a 13 year old? It doesn't make sense. It don't make no sense. Sofia La Tortilla speaks, sis. Oh, yeah. They should have got like a Mexican girl from Texas. Yeah, exactly. Una que represente. I don't know. I know that either way, I was always going to be like, fuck that bitch, fuck that bitch. But Selena was very proud and of being also, brown. She's like white. She's mm -hmm. not even that brown. Controversia. ¿Qué vas a decir, Sofía? Uh, I was going to say about the um, 30, um, something else. The 30 year old. That she's 30, right? Yeah. Sorry, mami, no te deja hablar. I'm Pero sí, si, it's really like. Como, would you. Remember, we saw the pictures of the girl, right? Mm -hmm. As playing the 14 year old. Your eyes are so bright, Sophia. Thank you. So bright like a, so bright like a diamond. A, so bright like a diamond. Mm. Anyway, so much. So, so, anyways, we're gonna cut the chiotes. We're gonna clean the chiotes. We're gonna clean the papas. Who's gonna help me with the carrots? Me. Who's gonna come help me with the chayote? Yo. In the calabacita? Yo. Okay, let's do this. Yo yo. Yo, yo, yo. yo to the yo, to the yo, yo, yo. yo, yo. yo. Mm. Okay, that chayote, let's do it. Mother, mm. were you using a knife? You're not supposed to put your finger on top. Why not? It's bad for you. What? It's not hurting me? I don't know what culinary teacher said it. The culinary teacher kissed my ass. <gasps> all of my ass. Oh my goodness. She went to school. Oh, okay, <laughs> I respect her. She went to school. Well, see, I don't know. Then, cut this. Some people they are gonna um I know you guys are gonna do this but this is not good because skin is where all the nutrients are at. All the vitamins. All the vitamins, all the good stuff, mm -hmm. all the juicy pussy stuff. Okay. What? All the juicy pussy stuff. So to clarify, like this and like this, this, this. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. Mm, okay. Am I wrong or am I right? Or am I right? Am I right? Isn't it when you cut this in half? This? It's called half moon. It's called sunset. Half moon. Is that a sunset? Yes, it is. But that's a moon. Half a moon. Isn't that a moon? Yes, it is. It looks like a moon to me. That's like um, that's like a moon like once a month. Oh, you know what? I'm getting confused. It's because in Spanish, when you tell people media luna, oh. so it's, it's stuck with me. You're always debating me, Miss Debater. Anyway, we're gonna um, pelar la zanahoria. My mom told me that all the all the um vitamins were in this. But it looks ugly and dirty or like caldo if you leave the outside of it. I don't know. It gives it looks more prettier. 
Like, do you think my mom's right? I think she's right, but I rather have her the other way. But like, look, like, she's a difference. I don't know why. Remember that carrot lady that's addicted to carrots? See. So there's this girl and um, it's called Strange Addictions or some shit, and she's fucking addicted to this shit. And then her son, when she had her son, it came out um, he came out with orange hair or ginger, no? He's ginger, see. Orange hair. Why am I wearing orange today? So I'm wearing an orange shirt and orange shorts. <laughs> Pues yo no sé por qué, but I like, um, some girl, some girl in my, in the comments said I reminded her of cho, her chorizo. Because he's in jail, so the shirt reminds him of me. I was like, oh, hell no. No, pues está triste porque, you Porcita. know. I see every time we would go visit my brother-in-law in, um, in jail, there was a gang of bitches. Like, if you guys want to get yourself a bitch, go to the jail, and there's always lonely bitches. Mm -hmm, there are. There's, there's like girls who are all in love, girls who are screaming, crying, with like 10 kids. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, ¿Qué pasó, Sofía? We saw a girl with 10 kids last night. That's my friend. So there's this girl, right? She's so fucking crazy. She was pregnant, and I saw her at the clinic. And I said, how you doing? I'm not going to say her name. And she's like, ah, she's me. You know, I'm pregnant, but I don't know if it's the Sancho's or my husband. And I was like, why the fuck are you telling me this shit? And then she said, after she had the baby, I guess the baby looked like the Sancho. But I don't even know how the fuck she gets herself a fucking boyfriend. She was in jail looking for another vato. Oh my God, she's a homeless. But she used to be, when she was younger, she was really pretty. She was? That girl, yeah, yeah, yeah. She was really pretty. She was like one of the top notches from the, from the hood. Oh. Because my mom, her mom was really pretty, and her mom was a yard duty. If you guys know who I'm talking about, wink ones. It's a marvelous Mandy doing her thing. Chicken wing. Chicken wing. Chicken chicken wing wing. Okay. Sofía la tortilla, cómo estás? Muy bien. ¿Cómo están los hijos? ¿Y por qué no hijos? Mmm, pues. Estás siendo pendeja ni nos estás ayudando. Anyway, we're gonna take this part out. Because it makes it look musty, crusty, motherfucking lusty. Sofia, ¿puedes apagar la, la luz from the pasillo, please? Sí, mamá. Por favorcito, mi chulita, hermosita, cara de babosita. Sí. Hi, papi. I clean your hands. clean your hands? Yes. Oh, my gosh, milagro. Ni my ten... hands, ew. Your hands, ew. What are you doing? We so, we're letting it boil for 20 minutes. And ahora sí, we're going to... Um, Add the zanahoria, the carrots. You could take out the onions. I like the onions, but you know some people don't. So do what you do. Do what you do. Just wash your shoes. Okay, motherfuckers. I cut the papa in four. Leave the skin if you want. Si no, chingue su madre. Five. Five, I guess. Chingue su madre. Mira que chulo. So I'm adding the papas. So we're gonna show you guys the picture of the actors and then Selena. I think J Lo rocked that shit. Que no? See, she rocked it. Okay. I, I my oils right now. They're um kidnapped. Um, my father-in-law like put them in some corner. I don't know what the fuck is going on. So that's why I'm using two pots instead of just one. And this is um I don't know who this thirty-year-old playing a fifty-year-old. Oh my Netflix god. Netflix is being cheap. She's supposed to be Selena right there at fifteen. How does that make sense? It don't make no sense. Selena is like literally a legend. Are you gonna get actors to play like half her life? What? ¿Qué pasó con eso? You fucked up, Netflix. You fucked up. Huelga, huelga, huelga. <laughs> we are almost finito. Aquí le voy a echar el, pasoti el pasotito. Make a chulada. Make a chulada. Y la hierba buena de me. I know. I might make a pinche dedo por pendeja. Some people don't put epazote, but I do. I love to eat the epazote. It's good for the motherfucking soul. Y ahora sí le voy a echar el corn. Es que yo me comí dirty kitchen right now. Stove. It's been a long end day, bitch. <laughs> been so bad. No, just kidding. I love see the guest of honor, el chayote. You could take out the seed if you want. If you're not like, como se dice, comfortable with seeds. I don't really fucking care. You know, plantas son plantas. Veggies are veggies. Very important for your health, for your motherfucking soul, for your beneficial nutrition of the motherfucking world. Ever since I was a kid, every time my mom made a caldo, she would always put her chicken. Always, always, always. And in my head, I'm like, it doesn't fucking make sense. Veggies and then her chicken. 
but that's how my mama made it so i'm gonna make it like that too so anyways the last thing is gonna be the repollo the red chicken and the calabacitas mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so my mom just called me like three minutes ago and she told me that one of her childhood friends actually died from a stroke and she was sad because she's like when i was a teenager she was a teenager and um I was boyfriend's boyfriend and girlfriend with your dad, and she was the lookout. She would bechaba aguas, you know what I'm saying? And I told her, how do you feel? And she's like, sad because she's not here anymore. And I told her, you know what? You should be happy or grateful that she didn't suffer. Cause barely like last year, she was dancing zapateado. She was celebrating her birthday. And this year she died, but I feel like she's going somewhere better feel bad for her daughter because those are the ones that we suffer man when our, the moms pass away the children i don't even know how to make how many messages i've gotten about treasure your mama i love your mama my mom died when i was 13 my mom died when i was 20 my mom died 17 years ago my mom died two years ago and, and we're never gonna be the same we need our mama oh my god I'm getting emotional no but for real like on the real treasure your mama you still have her so El repollo y las calabazas. Nomás así, arriba. <laughs> Te digo, pues, amiga. I'm putting this bitch everything. Check the motherfucking way. You could put garbanzo too. But, I don't know. I don't like the ones that come in the can. And I didn't, I couldn't find any fresh ones. So, this is how we do it. I'm also gonna add some cilantro because what? Because fuck it, verdad? Yeah, it looks good. It looks good. Yo ahora sí, le voy a echar a little bit of chicken flavor bouillon. It's good like that, but it needs a little bit of more. I love chicken soup. It's the bouncy feet. You like it? Mm -hmm. Un poquito mucho. Po mucho. <laughs> ya ni sabes qué decir, cabrona. Mix it. Don't boil it too much. Because if you boil it too much, I don't know. Your fucking chicken is going to be too loosey. Your veggies are going to be too loosey. See, like this one right here, the papa, it's already getting too loosey. We don't want that in our life. So now I'm gonna add the final touch, some oregano. This is like if you want to. If you don't want to, tampoco. You know what I'm saying? It's like, como se dice, a decision that you have to make. I love oregano. And it gives it like, look, color, sabor, amor, cara de valor. Yeah. Black pepper, finishing touch. Mira que chula. That's a clean ass motherfucker right there. Right there, right there. Right there. So here are our plates. See right here? I like the bone. As you may know already. Which one's mine? The middle one. So we squeeze the lemons. Mandy's gonna run, so she just wanted veggies. Sophia just wanted veggies. I like that pasote. I thought you were going to give me some chicken as well. Mm. ¿Quieres una alita? Sí, por favor, mamá. Okay. Mandy just wants to eat. She's like, chingue oh. su madre, nomás que está calientito. Sí. No, está bien, mami, está bien. Yo le voy a echar poquito de salsita, salsita al mío. Mm. Woo, they're hot. So I got my caldito, right? Okay, I'll do it for face. It's fine, I'll take it off. So we have the caldito. Woo! Be very, Woo. very, very, very careful. Let me take mm. the first sip. Mm. Oh, it's hot. Mm. It warms your soul. And your bubble. This one's mine, but now I'm going to take the first sip. <laughs> this one is mine. It's <laughs> hot. So, yeah. it's so small. Wait, Mommy, and mm. this is a great meal because we are going to winter in October. So, oh. the weather is just kind of changing. Mother, may you tell them about my pants? Mandy has five of the five pairs of the same pants. That's why they see her wearing the same fucking pants. <laughs> so I love them. She's obsessed. She's got Fashion Nova. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. This is real fucking Mexican soul food. Mm. I've had forgot. I haven't ate caldo de pollo in a while. I forgot the feeling. You forgot the warmness. Oh my god, it's fucking good. Ooh, I'm just trying to get a piece of chicken. I remember, I remember when I was there, I was like, caldo de pollo, ew, I don't want no caldo de pollo. Because it's like, if you think of like, oh, like, caldo oh, de thing. pollo is like the same thing. My mom would make it like at least once a week. But now if you think about it, it's easy to make. That's why she would make it, because she had to work all the time. Oh. 
Mm. It's easy to make and long last. No, it, it lasts for two days. Mm -hmm. We make a big pot, and that should last for two days. Isn't that expensive, Maxi? Mm -mm. Oh, that makes sense. I just bought two pollos. How come most of the Mexican food is very affordable? Because you got like three kids, you have to feed all of them. Mm. The reason I'm not eating it that well because it's too hot. Still, quieres un hielito? Yes, please. Can you cut a little piece? I go, go. So I got Mandy some fake ass fucking is how much Gatorades? Mm -hmm. Say it, say it. Um I feel like I live in um what's it called? I live I feel, I feel like I live in Colorado. She gave me fake Gatorades. This is though. I told you we're trying yeah. to save money for Arizona and Texas. Okay, mother. But I sacrificed my soul. Yeah. Sabi igual, te haces pendeja. I know, but it's like the free that have a gator in my hand. It Who? tastes better. Who grew up with fake cocoa puffs? Who could fucking relate? Siempre, siempre, my mom would buy the fake cocoa puffs, the fake cornflakes, the fake everything. Sometimes that's all you could do, Scooby motherfucking Rita. Tienes que aguantar. No, but tell me if this is shit in that bomb. Is it nature bomb? It is bomb. Bomb skis, skis, motherfuckers. Mmm, 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 mmm. Mommy, did they put oregano? Yeah, I put oregano, I put black pepper. Mm, I love oregano. But anyways, um, see you guys in Phoenix. Be there, be motherfucking square. Um, November 1st. See you guys in San Antonio, November. What was it, sir? I think November. I think 7th. Mm -hmm. I'll leave the link. San Antonio. San Antonio. San Antonio. I'm gonna take a nap after this. Anyways, shout out to. Um, oh no! We got to say happy birthday to Jasmine Garcia. Today is her birthday. Happy, happy birthday, birthday to you. Cha cha cha. Happy birthday to you. Cha cha cha. Happy birthday, dear Jasmine Garcia. Happy birthday to you. Shout out to all my bird gang, 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 motherfuckers. Peace and motherfucking love. Let me can say, William. Fucking boys, fucking fire, fire.